So now in this video we are going to start implementing the user interface of our sign up screen. So on the sign up screen we will replace this placeholder and we will return a scaffold widget body single child scroll view since we will have multiple widgets multiple text fields so the user must have a scrolling option if the phone screen size is small we will apply padding from all sides so we can say edges edge insets dot all and from all side it will be 10 child column widget children widget and we are going to add some assets okay I will provide these images please download these images once you download these then you can simply copy all these images and go back to your project right click on your project name new and let's create a new folder let's give it name as assets so assets folder is created now right click on assets folder new and let's create a new folder by the name images so inside the assets we have a folder by the name images right click on images click paste click OK so now inside the images folder we have our images files as you can see now go to the popspec.yml file and in here we have to include this path in order to use the images in our project so for that purpose here you can see assets okay remove the comments from it now remember the assets a must be in proper alignment with this hash or you can say this uses material u as you can see no space forward no space backward otherwise you will get errors so here we have to provide the path for example this dash remember this dash must be below the second s of this assets okay just like this no space forward no space backward okay just exactly below the second s of this of this assets okay just like this you can see that so inside the assets folder we have another folder by the name images so we can say inside the assets folder another folder the name is images slash whatever is inside this folder is that is now the part of our this user app project once you do that click on pub get and it will add this okay if the exit code is zero it simply means that this has been added successfully in our project so now come back to the sign up screen dot dot if you see this as suggestion click on get dependencies and then click on ignore so now in here we can add our logo so we can say image dot asset and here we have to provide the image path so inside the assets folder we have another folder by the name images and within that images folder we have the image by the name logo logo.png so we will add that logo.png now let's open up the phone just to test it if it is working or not so you can click here on this no device selected and from here you will see your available devices so I will open up my Android emulator of course you can open the iOS simulator if you are using Mac so as you can see it is open now I, I will go to the man dot dot because here we have to provide the initial route that is from where our app will start so for now as we have our sign up screen so you can say sign up screen okay just like that and now let's install the app by clicking the play button it will now start installing the app on our phone so let's wait for it so the app is running now and you can see this is how our logo looks now we do not want this debug banner and also we want our app theme to be dark so for that purpose first of all let's remove this debug banner so we can simply say here debug show check mode banner and set this to false so that banner is removed now we have to set the theme we can simply remove this theme data 
and we can say a theme data dot dark copy with and here we can specify the sp scaffold background color which will be color start black so you can see this is how it looks like the black theme is applied to our app let's quickly add a title also so after the image we can say text widget and we can say create a users slash s create a users account if you check it looks like this now we will apply some textile on it in order to make it look beautiful so the font size will be 26 let's see how it looks as you can see and also let's make it bold so we can say font wet font wet dot bold 